Welcome to another exciting episode of The Film Files, the podcast where we delve deep into the fascinating world of filmmaking. Today we're shining a spotlight on the 1987 crime comedy film Stakeout, featuring the talented duo of Richard Dreyfus and Emilio Estevez. Get ready to join us on a thrilling journey through this captivating buddy cop film that blends humor, suspense, and romance. <laughs> Set against the backdrop of Seattle, Stakeout introduces us to two detectives, Chris, played by Richard Dreyfus, and Bill, played by Emilio Estevez. Assigned to surveil a beautiful woman named Maria McGuire, played by Madeline Stowe, they become entangled in a dangerous game of cat and mouse as they try to catch an escaped convict. As Chris and Bill embark on their stakeout mission, they are initially frustrated by the tediousness and boredom of the task. Forced to spend long hours together in close quarters, their camaraderie is tested. As the stakeout progresses, we witness a dramatic turn of events. Chris finds himself captivated by Maria's allure. Despite strict instructions to maintain a professional distance, Chris cannot resist his growing infatuation. This unexpected development creates a complex and dangerous situation as he risks his career and the success of the mission. Richard Dreyfus delivers a standout performance as Chris, and Emilio Estevez shines as Bill Reimers, Chris's loyal partner, who finds himself torn between supporting his friend and upholding the law. The real gem here is the chemistry between Dreyfus and Estevez, as they banter and pester their stakeout colleagues. Behind the scenes, Stakeout was helmed by director John Badham, known for his ability to skillfully blend genres. His adept storytelling keeps audiences on the edge of their seats, eagerly anticipating the resolution of the entangled web of relationships. One interesting aspect of the production was the choice of filming locations. The city of Vancouver, British Columbia, stood in for Seattle, providing a visually appealing backdrop for the story. With its architectural similarities and picturesque scenery, Vancouver convincingly portrayed the urban atmosphere and rain-soaked streets that are synonymous with Seattle. The on-screen chemistry between Richard Dreyfus and Emilio Estevez, who portrayed partners and best friends Chris Lecce and Bill Reimers, was a highlight of Stakeout. The two actors developed a genuine rapport that added depth and authenticity to their characters' relationship. Their camaraderie and natural chemistry contributed to the film's overall success. Behind the camera, cinematographer John Seal played a vital role in capturing the moody and atmospheric visuals of Stakeout. His work elevated the storytelling and enhanced the viewer's experience. Now let's dive into some fascinating trivia about the making of Stakeout. Did you know that the film was originally titled Coast to Coast? It was only during the production process that the title was changed to Stakeout, which more accurately reflects the story's central premise. Another interesting tidbit is that the famous scene where Chris's car crashes into a fruit stand was not initially planned. Richard Dreyfus known for his improvisational skills, suggested the idea on set, and the director and crew embraced it. The unexpected moment added a touch of humor and spontaneity to the film, becoming one of its most memorable scenes. Additionally, the role of Maria Maguire was highly sought after by many actresses at the time. It was initially offered to Demi Moore, but due to scheduling conflicts, the part eventually went to Madeline Stowe. Stowe's performance brought a unique blend of vulnerability and strength to the character making Maria a pivotal figure in the story. Stakeout became a commercial success upon its release, grossing over $65 million worldwide. Audiences were drawn to its winning combination of comedy, suspense, and the dynamic performances of the cast. The film's popularity cemented its status as a beloved entry in the buddy cop genre. Stakeout remains one of my favorite movies from the 1980s. It's one of the better buddy cop movies that came out of that century and Dreyfus and Estevez are really funny in this. It's also an exciting thriller, and Aidan Quinn also shines as the villain, the convict that is also Maria's ex-boyfriend. This is one of those must-see movies that you need to add to your watch list if you haven't seen it already. And with that, we conclude this episode of The Film Files, where we explored the behind-the-scenes details and fascinating trivia surrounding the making of Stakeout. If you enjoyed this deep dive into the world of filmmaking, stay tuned for more captivating tales from the realm of movies. Until then, keep watching and keep exploring.